Um, recently, I was visiting friends in Tacoma, which meant that we had to do screenings of The Hand That Rocks the Cradle and go see The House in the Greenhouse. And then, mm-hmm. of course, 10 Things I Hate About You, which I had not <laughs> done a proper rewatch of in a while. And I forgot how nearly perfect that is as like a teen rom-com. <laughs> so smart, so well done. You have not aged a day. Um, oh, yeah. And I'm and I'm <laughs> so curious what what was just your memory of of doing that movie, which had to have been fun. It was an amazing catch, Julia Stiles and Heath Ledger, and you know it it's so great. My, a friend of my wife's was just telling her like, oh, I saw Joe um on on this movie on TV. Uh, what was it? It was like uh, he was I don't know. He was probably like ten or eleven or something like that. <laughs> And my wife was like, I don't know, what, what do you mean? Yeah, he was like in school or something. I was 17 when I was, <laughs> when I was in 10 Things I Hate About You. So speaking of aging, i um, delighted to look like a man finally. Like a 10-year-old? No, yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> um, but uh, now that, that movie, I think, I think a big part of why audiences really like it so much is because we really were all having a great time. All of us. We all made friends. We all hung out every night. There wasn't a lot for us to do in Tacoma. And so we would just like hang out and, and you know, put on CDs and talk about music and things like that. And and so I think a lot of that uh, friendship and chemistry that you see on screen, it comes off like that because it was pretty real. 